so I can In start recording. Three, two, okay. hmm? Yeah, one, go. Three, Dang. two, one, go. Dang, got you. Welcome All right, so JG's uh, numbers change constantly. Yeah, let's let's see if uh, we stay synced. Let's go. This is of course Stellaris, All Dragon, JG, Zerfall. Hi. In the house. <laughs> The the true inheritors of the universe, the the turtles and uh, the uh, grody the friends mammals. of the turtles, mammals. Ugh. Oh, empire trade value increased by ten percent. Yes, I need that. <laughs> then I need insider trading. Then I need. Oh wow, I actually really needed the diplomacy stuff. I just, other than getting a federation going, I really would have gone with the federation stuff kind of last. <laughs> Hey, and I finished the research. I can do mineral purification, advanced Corvette holes. Yeah, the Empire trade value plus 10% is pretty nice. Yeah. I don't think we need an active sensor link anymore. I think we technically have that with each other now. Yeah, I think you might be right. Oh god, two purple techs! Oh god, which one do I choose? Oh, it's a, it's like Sophie's Choice. <laughs> <laughs> Except that in Sophie's Choice, there was clearly a right answer. You just didn't like to have to make the call. <laughs> I mean, come on, it's not that hard. Ah, uh, I see the uh, the aliens that uh, the the fox is bred with. Uh <laughs> seal of quality. Show us your wares. What do you got? Uh... A Trium Atmospheric Deodorizer Diploma Deployment. No, not interested. I am not spending all of those uh, all of those alloys on that. That is not worth it. Oh, I have another uh, starbase capacity. I should probably build something. Go ahead and upgrade this one. Oh, here we go. We got some rudimentary robots. Rudimentary are we going to put them to work robots. and gain a robot pop? Or are we going to scrap them for minerals? 100 minerals. Psh, let's put them to work. Yeah. <laughs> Pardon me. Oh, wow, that was almost right in the mic. <laughs> oh, my tomb world is coming along nicely. It's It'll nice be such a beautiful place to live, won't it? Well, I mean, it's populated by weird-looking dudes, the Weezerakians. The Weezandokadosians? Yes. At last we know what Kados is. This planet, Weezand, is a fancy word for Tomb World. Somebody somebody just, like, you know, really made my day by pointing out in the comments of some video where I was talking about how, wow, like 800 videos worth of... Tales of Asperian, I don't even remember the story. They were like, at, randomly came out and said, oh, I actually showed a friend of mine the We Stand of Kato's video. And I was like, oh, wow. <laughs> I'm researching all purple text right now. I uh, I like that. And oh, then next that. up, you'll have all missing makers. I'm seven months away from jump drive technology, so... <laughs> I'll have That's to ask, pretty sweet. I'll have to ask uh, all to explain the mechanics of it, because I kind of don't remember them. Uh, well, if you have a ship right now, you'll have a uh, a button up the top, which is, looks like a little leap. It's grayed out right now. If I were to click on a ship, you mean? Okay. Yeah, that does kind of help. A little, yeah, little it's bit. Initiate jump. Gotcha. Yeah, and there's also you can use the the J key on your keyboard, which is pretty important. It's located between the H and the K. Got it. Well, unless, of course, you have, a, like, a Dvorak keyboard. All right, who is selling uh, minerals right now? Because you're, you're, like, tanking the prices. I'm selling minerals right now, and you can't stop me. 
coming and murder you, and then I'll stop you. Yeah, good luck with Whoa. that. Whoa. Good luck with that's that. That's a great idea. Oh, in the meantime, uh, so that one <laughs> slavery, that, that one human slave that's being sold is a uh, male, so I'm just assuming he's like, it's a reverse Fifty Shades situation. He totally volunteered <laughs> for this. But I would like to know what civilization you are buying these slaves from. Uh, because I, th- I think it's got to be the the um, uh, the Leginchus. Yeah, I think it is because Problem is, they're, they're authoritarian. In a fe- they're in a federation now, so I can't just start claiming their shit without expecting repercussions. And I can't build anything on their planets to because uh, I don't have enough uh, influence right now. All right. Let's see if I save the ransomers, or not the ransomers. Save the uh, people who are being Held ransomed. ransomed by ransomers. Yeah. Hmm. I I think I got to start claiming their systems because that that needs to stop. I guess I could break my treaty with them. I pro- it's probably a good idea to break the migration treaty if they're going to enslave people. Yeah, you I, might want to. I got really good relations well, with them though. They really like me. They're friendly. Yeah, but now they're in a different federation. Yeah. I can break the migration treaty. Welp. I gained 40 influence, at least. They're still friendly, though. Oh, the... Communication from Megazar Continuance. Custodian, hold on, I need to pause, I'm sorry. This is new to me. That's okay. Custodian Protocol 7124 activated. Initializing resource transfer to compliant organi- organic civilization. Message follows. Error data block corrupted. Error data block corrupted. Error data block corrupted. We graciously accept. Th- oh, they're just giving me stuff. Okay. They're not asking for anything That's in cool. return. Cool. Oh, Yet. Okay. Oh. Well. Oh. We're uh, we're building an executive retreat on Earth, by the way, JG. Okay. So they can um, spend their certainly spend their uh, tourist dollars on Earth. Yeah, make make sure that there are uh, plenty of uh, sexy sexy Earthling ladies to uh, dance for the turtles. Yeah, and sexy to turtles means what? Like, should they should they like put big <laughs> fake shells on their backs? Well, we we understand that you had a uh, um a a show uh was it like uh Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, I think it was. Um Oh, you want April on yeah, the Yeah, something like like the females of of those. That that would be perfect for us. <laughs> but make sure they're 18 years old. Yeah, I, at at least if they say so, that's that's fine. That's good enough. <laughs> you too. That's not even a little gross, you guys. <laughs> Tell I'm spending money like it's water. And water like it's money. Soon I'll have moat stabilization. If only I had moats. If only. I'd be able to see them, uh, even if I didn't currently have the ability to to grab them, wouldn't I? Yeah. Uh, yes. Yes, you would. Like, I have some over in the Soyama system. Maybe I need to be working on trade routes. Maybe that is part of my problem. Oh, goody. Yeah, trade routes seem to be okay. I'm about to go say hi to the psionic entity. Hi, psionic entity. How are you guys doing? Don't eat Planted me. bonus. Bonus secundus. Currently has population of two of the weird uh, weird Zaraki guys. Oh no, I have received a diplomatic <laughs> insult from the hierarchy of Quarble. 
Well, forgive me if I dim my display, human. I simply cannot stand to look at your nauseating appearance. Well, you called me. <laughs> Jeez, man. It's like you're trying to provoke me. I guess it's time to start claiming war garble systems then, because I, uh... I kind of want to stop the slave trade, but I don't think the war garbles are in a confederacy, mm. are they? Uh, they have a mutual no. defense pact with the Beldross Benighted Kingdom, so they would be the guys yeah. against whom to claim systems. <laughs> Benighted. I know that's not really the name, folks. Oh, man. So these robots had some uh, masters that were uh, destroyed somehow. Hmm. I wonder how. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna drop my claim on the hunter system since uh, you're gonna take those guys over at some point, right, Zerf? Yeah, what the hell? I'll put it back. <laughs> <laughs> There's no real point in ever dropping a uh, claim. I don't think. I mean, if it's against an, a player, then yeah, it doesn't matter. I mean, but I'm not getting the I'm not getting the influence back. No, and that's, that's basically why. Speculative hyperlane breaching. I can get experimental subspace navigation, <laughs> even though I've already got jump drives. Yeah, that's uh, it's definitely not the order it's supposed to go in. <laughs> and I can get open markets or entente, entente coordination. <laughs> And taunt coordination is not as good as open markets. Not even close. All right, Zerf on uh, Bafsh von Ronson. Uh, I'm going to build you an amusement park because uh, that'll help with the amenities issue that you have there. Yes. Manifest Destiny. Mm. Why have I not checked out that wormhole over here? Ah. I think the wormholes in your space, JG, are like the only ones that I can't, I haven't uh, checked out yet. Of the ones that I can get to, at least. Have you already? But I mean, I've checked them out, so you should. We're sharing map info, right? Uh, it doesn't work with the wormholes. Oh. Oh, well. I guess if I'm tanking the price of minerals, I could probably sell <laughs> fewer minerals. But I'm not stopping completely. I was mostly joking, but... No. Well, it does have an impact, doesn't it? Um, it, it does, but I mean, pretty it's... minimal. Well, no, actually, it's a pretty big, but um, I don't, I don't know that slowing down the sale is really gonna make that much difference. And I mean, I am getting four hundred four minerals right now. I guess I could start building fleets of corvettes to protect my space lanes. I'm trying to think of something to do other than just wait for each new research to pop. I mean, I have a, a planet with uh, 15 mining districts, exceptional quality minerals, so minerals from jobs plus 25%. It's kind of ridiculous. build Federation Corvettes and then just use them to patrol my spaceways. And I better build up my own capacity before I start doing that kind of nonsense. Um, but, but the Federation fleets don't count towards... Uh, you, you don't spend anything on them once they're built. They're free. Yeah, but then... Maintenance. I guess as long as, as long as I'm the leader of the Federation, I guess that makes sense. Because I'm just going to selfishly use them for my own purposes. Yeah, go ahead. Mm. <laughs> Or 
Breath of the this construction queue. Oh, uh, if you do decide to go to war um, against uh, the uh, war bar blargle right. guys and the Beldross, keep in mind that they're going to go right into your northern space through that wormhole. Unless you get some uh, defenses there. Are they able to use wormholes now? Well, I don't know if they can or not, but it's better to assume they can. Yeah, uh, where's the wormhole? I forget. Uh... Oh, then in, in the uh, Belladross, have a wormhole that has been explored. All right, so the other end of that is. Uh, Gingan, so I need to throw in some defenses here, which I probably should do anyway, because now they're on the border with um, another empire that I'm friends with, but that could change, especially if they keep selling my people as slaves. <laughs> I'm just stuck. On, I, I guess I got to get over it. I mean, I can't impose my cultural morals on them. If they want to sell my people slaves, I need to be tolerant of that. Well, maybe uh, no, not. No, you no, know what? Maybe no, not. Maybe no. I don't got to let that one go. No. Uh. <laughs> yes. Tomb World of 10 or Tomb World or Desert World of 12. Who do I want it to get next? Savannah World of 10. It's weird. I can I can settle uh, Tomb Worlds, but Alpine Worlds are still kind of not that attractive. <laughs> Oh, hey, whatever uh, species uh, can settle tomb worlds, I've got them down there. Oh, the Wee, the wee Ziraki. Okay. Yeah, no, I, yeah. They're, they've been a boon. I could settle a, a tomb world. I don't know if I want to yet. I still have plenty of other worlds. Well, actually, a size 17 tomb world. Yes, let's do that one. Hmm. Right. And it's in the system Weir. By the way, Zerf. Yes. There there may be a, a new system that has appeared off my border. A new system. Towards the center of the galaxy. Oh, hey, there has been. What is that about? And its name oh, is so fuzzy that it's hard You to got see. the ultimate planet of goofy egg econ. You got the precursor stuff? I got all of them. Man, you jerk. I just never got another one. That's a pretty heavy score. Yeah, it was pretty sweet. Oh, man, the best right. on five star authority is no longer a valid rival. I have to pick on someone my own size now, apparently. <laughs> How dare they? Although somebody opened their borders to me, so that's nice of them. Another L side inside on the way. You will need to take their the the system that has that when the time comes. Just so you know. Yeah. Otherwise, I'm just wasting research. Well, it's not wasted. Um. Because in the end, you can turn that into other things. You can like liqui liquidate all of your Elgate insights if that's what you wanted to do. So that might be might actually be good, but <laughs> come on, just need just need a little bit more. What do you want? You want some minerals? How's that? Nope, you don't want minerals. Um... Oh, there we go. Commercial pact. 
Like, I'm getting just under 9 from this, and they're getting, like, uh, 26 energy credits and almost 10 um, consumer goods, and they're like, eh, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know about this. <laughs> See, the deal seems too good to be true. Just take the freaking deal. I don't think I have very many but it is about me. time to uh, call it an episode. It's about that time. Oh, man, I got this meteor coming towards me. Ooh, it's Sounds gonna be a exciting. cliffhanger. Oh yeah. Oh, I see that. What'll happen next uh, time, folks? You just have can to get a see. ship in there to. I hope so. I sent my whole. Uh... <laughs> I mean, I'm only two more jumps away, so I should oh, get there okay. pretty quick. All right. Well, we'll see how that uh, turns out next time. See you Bye, then, everyone. Folks. Bye. Look up meteors. <laughs>